Hi everyone, this is Teacher Jane of Teach Talk, where learning is fun and easy. If this is your first time watching our videos, don't forget to subscribe and click that bell button so you'll get notified on our next videos. Welcome to Sensha Amazing! Kung saan pag-uusapan natin ang science concepts from grade 7 to grade 12. From general science, biology, chemistry, physics, and earth science. At dito, bida ang agham. Have you ever wondered when you mix salt and water, when you mix it well, wala ka na makikita na pieces of salt doon sa salty water solution? That's what you're going to find out today. In our Sensha Amazing episode, pag-uusapan natin ang tungkol sa substances and mixtures. Sa panahon ngayon, napaka-init and we have a lot of drinks that we want. But have you ever wondered why your orange juice looks the same and has uniform characteristics, while your favorite sagot gulaman has distinct characteristics just like the sago or tapioca pearls and the gulaman? Well, it will be answered in our lesson for today. Remember this concept map? Matter can either be pure substances or mixtures. Under pure substances, matter can be elements or compounds. Under elements, matter can be metals, metalloids, or non-metals. Under compounds, matter can be organic or inorganic. If matter is a mixture, it can either be a solution, a colloid, or a suspension. Let's define the difference between pure substances and mixtures. Let's start with pure substances. What is it? A pure substance has a fixed composition and a definite set of properties. Hindi nag-iiba-iba. It is always homogeneous and it has uniform characteristics. For example, if I have a chair with me, and you have a chair with you, the properties of my chair and your chair are the same. How about mixtures? What is it? Mixtures have no definite properties and made up of two or more substances which retains its own properties. It can be homogeneous if seen as a single phase or heterogeneous if you can see other substances in it. An example of a homogeneous mixture is sea water o tubig sa dagat. An example of a heterogeneous mixture is muddy water. Did you know that the air we breathe is actually a mixture of gases. Take a look at this pie chart. The air is composed of 78% nitrogen, 20% oxygen, 1% water vapor, 0.97% inert gases, commonly argon, and 0.03% carbon dioxide. Mixtures have different types, depende sa substances na pinagahalo natin. It can be a solid-to-solid -solid mixture, solid-to-liquid mixture, gas-to-gas -gas mixture, liquid-to-liquid -liquid mixture, or liquid-to-gas mixture. Let's start with solid-to-solid -solid mixture. Some examples are vegetable salad, which is composed of different vegetables, concrete cement, which is composed of rock, sand, gravel, and cement, jewelries, 
which are made of different types of metal. In this mixture, two solids are combined. Next, we have liquid to liquid mixture. Some examples are vinegar, which is a combination of acetic acid and water, lotion, which is a combination of oils, water, and emulsifier, shampoo, which is a combination of acid, water, and other chemicals, such as ammonium chloride, glycol, sodium laureth sulfate, and other chemicals. Next, we have solid to liquid mixture. An example of this is water and ice. The solid part is the ice, and the liquid part is the water. We also have halo-halo, which is a combination of solid and liquid part. The solid parts are the various ingredients like the jellies, fruits, corn chips, and the liquid part are milk and water. Liquid to gas mixture. An example of this is soda drinks or yung cola. It is composed of water, sweetener, foaming agents, and a gas called carbon dioxide. And we also have gas-to-gas -gas mixture, kung saan dalawang gas ang nagahalo. Example of this is the air we breathe. It is composed of nitrogen, oxygen, and other gases. That ends our discussion and we will now have a quiz. I will give you 5 minutes to answer these items. Three After minutes. 5 minutes, we will check and you will see whether you learn something from our video. After three minutes,
Time is up. Let's check if your answers are correct. Number 1. What type of mixture is a steel bracelet? The keyword is steel. What composes steel? We have iron, copper, nickel, chromium, molybdenum, and tin. These are the commonly found residuals in steel. Therefore, number 1 is a solid-to-solid -solid mixture. Next, vinegar. Vinegar is composed of acetic acid and water, a liquid-to-liquid -liquid mixture. Number 3. Cola or soda drinks. Cola is composed of water, sweeteners, and carbon dioxide. It is a liquid-to-gas mixture. Next, the atmosphere. The atmosphere includes the air we breathe. This is composed of different gases. Therefore, it is a gas-to-gas -gas mixture. Last number, number 5, fruit salad. Fruit salad is composed of, of course, different fruits, making it a solid-to-solid -solid mixture. Some of you might think that there can be other answers for this item, but in classifying what type of mixture a substance is, you need to take a look at the commonly used ingredients. That ends our Sciencia Amazing episode. We hope that you've learned something from our video. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video to your friends so that we can learn together. Bye!